This is a quick video to show the color differences between the original 2011 pixel strip and the new GS8208 pixel strip. So at full brightness red, they look identical. We go to green, again, identical. Blue, no surprises there. Um, so again, mixing 100% of the primaries all looks fairly consistent. However, what does get interesting is when we start mixing colors in percentages. So if we go, that's 100% red and 50% green, we can start to see a difference in the color. Uh, again, if we slide that around, that's fairly consistent. So again, that looks, I don't know how it's appearing on camera, but that's green at uh, 230 out of 255, uh, 75 blue. Then we increase the red, we can still see a bit of a difference there. Uh, we'll try some different combinations. So that's interesting, that's at blue fairly low. Um, we can see the 8208 is a lot dimmer compared to the 2811. Uh, we'll see what that looks like on green. So yeah, same deal. So we'll nudge the red in. Again, yeah, red, it's um, the 8208 is a lot dimmer, which is probably a good thing because it does get overpowering when you have a lot of them on. So that's at about just over half brightness now, about 75 or probably closer to 90%. So that's back down to 20 out of 255. We're talking DMX values. So that's 16 on the green, 205, 68. That's 114. And that's seven on blue. What's that, 182? So yeah, it definitely looks like the um, 8208 stuff's a lot um, different at lower brightnesses. We'll just try everything together. That's at 100% brightness. So yep, that's 50% exactly. And down to 11. And back up to 100%. So yeah. Something to think about if you're going to be mixing this stuff with your existing lead strip.